This is a demo of the new C-Click Fix iPhone app released in January 2011. C-Click Fix is a free mobile application and web application that allows citizens to report non-emergency issues in the public space to officials and others that can fix them. To get started with C-Click Fix, all you do is open the app and click Start Report. Your GPS from your phone is going to grab your location. A new feature of the app is that you can locate issues outside of where your GPS is detecting you. We make this easy by dragging the map underneath the crosshairs and then get quickly giving you an address of the location where your new issue will be reported. Once you've located yourself in the issue, you can take a photo either from the camera or a new feature, you can take a photo from the gallery. This makes it easy to take a photo and then come back later on and add it to an existing report. You can quickly add a summary to the issue like graffiti or pothole or street light or other if the issue is not categorized. And then a quick description of the issue with additional information that will make it helpful for the individual responsible to fix it. Click submit and the issue is sent off in seconds. Once your issue is reported, you can see it documented publicly on the application and the C-Click Fix web app and anywhere else C-Click Fix data is displayed. Emails are sent immediately by watch areas to those accountable, such as your public works director or maybe your neighborhood cleanup group. It's that easy to report an issue on C-Click Fix. All issues on C-Click Fix get reported as open when they're first reported. When an issue has been fixed, you can go back into the application and close it. One of the neat features of the new app is that you can take out the phone, find issues nearby, and then filter them by keywords such as pothole. In this case, the user is standing in front of a patch pothole and is searching on the map for the pothole he sees has been resolved. When he scrolls to the bottom of the issue page, he sees a button that says close issue. He can take a photo of that issue or the resolved issue in this case, attach it, and change the issue status to closed with a little message that says maybe thank you or just notes that the issue has been resolved. The user hits submit and the status has been updated. The original user gets an email that says congratulations, your issue has been resolved. C-Click Fix is a social platform that's designed to connect neighbors to each other around common concerns. With that in mind, we've built in social features that help you share issues and let other neighbors know what your concerns are. We believe that by connecting each other, we can make stronger communities and resolve things quicker and more efficiently in our neighborhoods. The voting feature on C-Click Fix is a good example of this. Vote up your neighbor's issues or encourage your neighbors to vote up your issues to let people know that you care about what they're concerned about and to let government know what's really a pr priority in your neighborhood. Maybe you see an issue that doesn't have a photo yet. You can add a photo with a comment to the existing issue or of course change the status if the issue is resolved. And you can also see all the neighbors that are re uh, reporting in your community. You can see community groups that are reporting collectively. And on C-Click Fix, we track the number of civic points that you're earning based on the issues reported, the issues you've closed or voted for. It's a fun way to track what you're doing and how much of an impact you're making in your community using the web platform. Another new feature of the new application is the ability to share easily on Facebook, Twitter, or by email to help notify officials or to just share with your neighbors to let them know that you want your issue fixed and encourage them to vote as well. One thing we heard from users when we built our first app is they wanted a way to be able to create issues when they didn't have service, or be able to create issues and save them and then report them later. So say you're in a subway station on the new app and you have no service. You just open the app and it asks for an address. You can start the report with just text field address, city and state. Maybe you're gonna take the photo of the issue at this point, and maybe you'll add the summary and description now, but maybe you'll add it later. Maybe you'll just take the photo and save it to your camera and attach it later on from the gallery as well. 
Either way, you can save the issue as a draft and it will be stored in my reports on the application. Then when you're above ground or back in service, you can go back to your reports and under draft you'll see the issue you started to report. From there you can fill out the rest of the report. In this case you'll be filling out the summary and the description. and then verifying the address now that you have GPS service. The upgrade of the new app means lots of new features for our government clients as well. In Washington DC, one of our paying clients, you'll see when you open the app, there's a fancy new splash screen showing the city's logo. When reporting in DC, you're actually connecting directly to the city's 311 center. When an issue is created on C-Click Fix, a service request is posted into the Motorola City Work Order System. Citizens can go about using C-Click Fix as they usually do, and governments can go about using the Motorola Work Order System as they usually do. Adding a photo and everything else that you can do on C-Click Fix communicates with the Work Order System. One of the unique differences is that the service requests that are selected are actually the exact service requests that are inside the work order system. The city can provide additional information, such as when the bulk pe trash pickup day is, if it's citizens reporting a bulk trash issue. There's additional service requests uh, or secondary questions that can be added to each individual issue. Those are being pulled out of the system as well. It makes it quick and easy for citizens to communicate with local government. We have a number of cities on board with this system that are either managing C-Click Fix issues through our work order and tracking system or through their own. The City of New Haven, as an example, uses C-Click Fix as the primary civic reporting tool. We're connected into the CityWorks work order system in New Haven. CityWorks is available in hundreds of other cities. Tucson, Arizona and Corona, California are both cities that are using C-Click Fix dashboard to track and acknowledge their issues. Corona, California gives out Starbucks cards for people who have earned a certain amount of civic points. In Sim San Francisco, Open Through and One is implemented. This is a standardized web connection that allows C-Click Fix to connect to city governments. We're connected in both San Francisco and Washington, D.C. In San Francisco, you'll see a different set of service requests when you open the app than you see in D.C. Open Through and One is a great example of the collaboration between private businesses like C Click Fix and governments. Thanks for watching our brief demo. Please go to cclickfix.com slash apps to download the iPhone app, the Android app, and the Blackberry application, or just visit C Click Fix to report your issue from the web. We think you'll have fun reporting issues and fixing up your community.